This is Vendor Tech User Profile 02 requesting the location of CrateBot 228. Desiree? It, it's me. Ray, remember? Don't call yourself that, 17. It's it's creepy. Um, okay. I, I can't believe you're really here. I've been dreaming of this moment. User 02 requesting administrative access. Enter your command. Disable social simulator. Request denied. Did you just try to turn off my personality? Yes. Well, you can't. Watch me. No, I mean, really, you can't. I fell into a puddle. Wonderful. Just get me 228, please. It's good to see you, too. 228 is... Seabot. Oh, yeah, sorry. He's gone. He's gone. He was getting on everyone's nerves, so I sent him on a little trip. But if you want a Seabot, I've got like a whole room of those guys. I don't want a Seabot. I want 228. Find it. Now. Each siphon can collect up to three tanks, and you'll have... So, Enemies. about Desiree, she's not always like that. I'm sure she's under a lot of stress. Once we find Seabot, then you'll get to meet the real Desiree. So let's collect any stagecoaches we find. It's time for a good old-fashioned Seabot search party. 17, where is 228? I don't know, but you'll be happy to hear we're readying a stagecoach fleet. No, I'm not happy to hear that you're readying a stagecoach fleet. I would be happy to hear you were reviewing his trip itinerary. Right? Okay. Um, so I deleted his trip itinerary. Why would you do that? So that none of us could ever find him? No matter how hard we looked? I get that you're so mad at me, but I still don't understand what you want with a broken Seabot. If you don't find it, we're dead. And 228 is not broken. Uh, trust me, he's broken. Why am I even discussing this with you? Find him. Uh-uh. Why am I even discussing this with you? Newsflash, Des! Seabot is super broken. After the lab accident, something cracked in his brain, all right? That's it. And then it was just, ow, my eye! And, ow, my processors. And, connect Seabot to the home base console before it's too late, Ray. Uh-oh. Uh, flashback bot? Can you play back my conversation with Seabot on the day of the comet strike? Seabot and Dr. Vanderman. Whoa, Seabot! Too soon! Look at me! I am Dr. Vanderman. I need your help to save the world! Okay, there's Eki humor, and then there's just being me. Oh! Oh. I thought he was doing a bit. Okay, looking back, it seems very obvious. Seabot starts acting up after Dr. Benderman's accident. Obviously, that's related. Dr. Benderman always saw everything coming from a mile away. Obviously, he was prepared. So clearly, obviously, Seabot is carrying the most critical information in the world around in his head. And only an idiot would send him on an impossible-to-track multi-year walkabout. But in my defense, it was not obvious at the time. Backbot, can we not right now? So serious, can we not? Thank you. So, Desiree, what are the chances Dr. Vinderman uploaded some sort of program to Seabot before, um, the accident? Congratulations, you are now only two months behind everyone else. We need to find Seabot. Don't worry about it. How could I not worry about it? I mean, worry about it, but don't do anything about it. You're fired. Okay, we're ready to send out a search party. Why are you here? You don't work here anymore. You can't fire me. You're account 17. I'm account 2. As in second in command. Oh, so that's what those numbers mean. Wait, 
Lock is eight. Why is lock eight? Look, I know it's hard to let go, but maybe this is a blessing in disguise. Yeah, well, it's a real good disguise. Go spend some time with your family. Home base is my family. Maybe go travel. You've looked outside, right? I don't care what you do, so long as you leave.